Before we start the evening presentation, I would like to remind you all that Deus Ex is the property of Iron Storm, Square Enix and Eidos Interactive. We at Doomed from the start do not profit from this in any shape or form. Our only goal is to promote the talents of people who improved our experience with an already excellent game. Oh, and I do apologize for the jump cuts, but the game is a very hard one and it takes a while for it to save. That, and he died. A lot. <laughs> Your appointment to FEMA should be finalized within the week. I have already discussed the matter with the Senator. I take it he was agreeable? He didn't really have a choice. Has he been infected? Oh yes, most certainly. When I mentioned that we could put him on the priority list for the Ambrosia vaccine, he was so willing it was almost pathetic. This plague, the rioting, is intensifying to the point where we may not be able to contain it. Why contain it? Let it spill over into the schools and churches. Let the bodies pile up in the streets. In the end, they'll beg us to save them. I've received reports of armed attacks on shipments. There's not enough vaccine to go around, and the underclasses are starting to get desperate. Of course they're desperate. They can smell their death, and the sound they'll make rattling their cage will serve as a warning to the rest. Hmm. I hope you're not underestimating the problem. The others may not go as quietly as you think. Intelligence indicates they're behind the problems in Paris. A bunch of pretentious old men playing at running the world. But the world left them behind long ago. We are the future. We have other problems. UNATCO? Formed by executive order after the terrorist strike on the statue. I have someone in place, though. I'm more concerned about Savage. He's relocated to Vandenberg. Our biochem corpus is far in advance of theirs, as is our electronic sentience. And their ethical inflexibility has allowed us to make progress in areas they refuse to consider. The augmentation project? Among other things, but I must admit that I have been somewhat disappointed in the performance of the primary unit. The secondary unit should be online soon. It's currently undergoing preparation and will be operational within six months. My people will continue to report on its progress. If necessary, the primary will be terminated. We've had to endure much, you and I, but soon there will be order again. A new age. Aquinas spoke of the mythical city on the hill. Soon that city will be a reality and we will be crowned its kings. Not better than kings. Gods. What's up, JC? Your brother Paul is on his way to meet you at the dock. The NSF is raiding the island and shots have been fired. I repeat, find Paul. I will monitor your situation from HQ. Paul, oh, I thought you were in Hong Kong. Welcome to the Coalition, JC. I might as well start using your code name. Think I'd miss my brother's first day? Didn't think you'd have a choice. What's going on? The NSF. They hit one of our shipments. A few of them got away, but we trapped the rest in the statue. What are we waiting for? Looks like a textbook assault. The NSF took one of our agents hostage. The bots are holding the perimeter, but my orders are to hold back and send you in alone. I think someone high up wants to see how you handle the situation. All I've got with me is a pistol and an electric prod. I don't mind a test. But Unaco better issue some hardware. Remember that we're police. Stick with the prod. It'll stun your opponents or knock them unconscious. A non-lethal takedown is always the most silent way to eliminate resistance. Just in case, though, Manderly wants you to pick an additional weapon. A sniper rifle, a gep gun, or a mini crossbow. The crossbow. Sometimes you've got to make a silent takedown. Good thinking. With these tranquilizer darts, you'll have another non-lethal way to take down an enemy in addition to the prod. I get the idea. What's the first move? I'm going to give you a map of the island. If you can get to the North Dock, a UNATCO informant will give you a key to the statue doors. He responds to the code phrase, iron and copper. You could avoid a lot of fighting, though, if you found a back way to the statue. I'll see how it looks on shore. Your primary objective is the makeshift command center the terrorists have installed at the top of the statue. But don't forget about Agent Harriman. We think he's being held on the ground floor. What are my orders when I reach the command center? Interrogate the leader. We don't yet know why the terrorists would risk an open assault. 
You just gonna stay here? There's been some activity at sea. I'm going to watch the coast. Why'd they bring you back to New York? I don't know what they have planned. I messed up an assassination attempt on one of the triad leaders in Hong Kong. Yunatko pulled you out? It's a long story. You better head to the statue. What's your take on the situation, Corporal? The bots have them bottled up, sir. We'd go right in if it weren't for the whole back order. How'd they get one of our agents? Gunter went rogue on us. When the order came, he wouldn't pull back. Now you get to bail him out. Welcome aboard, Agent. Welcome aboard, Agent. Base is under lockdown until the danger's gone, Agent Denton. Right. How you guys holding up? Unatco Command made us pull back. I guess for Gunther's sake. What's the deal? We're ready to go in. We're taking a minimum force approach. We're cops, after all. Ask me. I think we should frag them all. You trespass on Unatco property. You get pumped full of lead. When due process fails us, we really do live in a world of terror. Thought you nanowogs were supposed to be badass killing machines. Guess I was wrong. Guess so. Some advice. You get out there, you're gonna have to tangle with some real sons of bitches. Best thing is to pick them off from 50 or 100 paces with a scope. I scored an extra one from a couple of thugs we dropped down by the dock. You can have it for 700 credits. I also picked up some 10 millimeter ammo and some crossbow darts. Say, 200 for one and 60 for the other. Shouldn't you turn that stuff over to the quartermaster? Sure, I will. As long as command has the rest of us on parade drill, someone might as well put this hardware to use. Here's 60 for the tranquilizer darts. So much for that minimum force approach. Everything was clear an hour ago. Then, boom!
That's the difference right there. Just take a look at him. Bad? Cut off his arm, replaced half his face. Herman, right? He's a good soldier. Killed three of our men. They'd have replaced his whole body if it would have improved performance. That's how you judge a man? By performance? Then eventually it's not about people, but upgrades, versions, functionality. All I know is we could use a few mechs for ops like this. As soon as we buy into the cult of the machine, we're just like them. Rhetoric. Always more rhetoric. power box must have been damaged in the raid. Don't cross through the arcs. I'm also picking up an EMP field here. If you're not careful, it'll suck away your bioelectrical energy.
all happened an hour ago. The barge docked and the NSF moved right on in. Offloading the cargo into speedboats. Our undercover man, Harley Philbin, should be somewhere out on the docks now. Just... About time you showed up. Iron and copper. The statue is copper on an iron frame, right? Passwords enough, pal. Don't think you know something about the lady I don't. My dad did tours out here. I heard that you can get me inside. Depends. You get your man out, take back the statue, whatever. But I know the commander and I don't want to see him get hurt. Here's a picture so you don't make a mistake. You can trust me. I'll take your word. Here's the key to the front entrance. Commander's not much of a soldier. He'll surrender as soon as he sees you. I need him alive because he's my main contact at the NSF. If he's dead, I don't have much of a business. Thanks. How do you know so much about the Commander? He's my main contact in the NSF. I need him alive and out on bail. UNITCO will probably keep him in custody. At least he has a chance if he's alive. I warned him, you know. I said right to his face. Don't take weapons into the lady. That makes you as bad as Unatko. Don't forget, it was the NSF that C4'd the statue in the first place. Unatko's here to put the pieces back together. Ask me? I think the government did it. They want people to think the NSF are terrorists. You with Philbin? I get a cut for bringing him over. Tell me what you know about the NSF operation. I'm not that high level. The more elite troops, they're the ones that took over the ship and unloaded it into speedboats. I think we're supposed to be a diversion. A ship? That's all I know. The commander gave me a 10 millimeter clip, a box of 30 out 6 ammo, and some crossbow darts, and said keep your head down. <laughs> like I'm gonna take on your NATCO troops. Want them? You can have the clip for 175, the 30 out 6 for 300, and the darts for 50. But if I was you, I'd avoid a head-on attack altogether and not even use the key Philbin got. I'd go in the statue from the back. Less security that way. I'll give you 50 for the darts. The commander's the whole reason my neighborhood turned into a war zone. Somebody should stick him full of these things like a roast pig.
Like Billy the Kid, man. We're outlaws. Did they find the shipment? Yeah, we got the whole supply. You can see the ship's lights crossing the bay. Guess y'all were right. So why aren't we pulling out? Mike's on the horn. Jojo wants a lead on the distribution network. Yeah, we don't have enough men to protect what we've got. That's what Jojo wants. I wonder, how does a guy with a tattooed forehead get to be an NSF colonel? Pardon me, but back in Alabama, we wouldn't let a man who wears earrings plan a military operation. I'd watch what I say about Jojo. He's got a temper. He's a punk and he's gonna get us all killed. The NSF is strong because it represents everyone's interests. Yeah, yeah. Security setup is strictly amateur stuff. Keep an eye out for ways to bypass it. These old pre-millennial buildings are riddled with ventilation shafts and maintenance tunnels. <laughs> 